Hi guys, this is Miss Lachey. I'm a part-time seller on eBay and Macari. I sell mainly media items, including books, CDs, DVDs, cassettes, and vinyl records. Today, I wanna to talk about what my experience has been selling vinyl records over the last 14 months. I started selling vinyl um, in December, 2020. Um, was new to selling vinyl. I uh, didn't know a whole lot um, other than, you know, what my preferences was. So I've learned a little bit along the way. Uh, here's a, just an example of a few of the vinyl records that I have right now in my eBay store. So as of uh, 14 months ago, I have sold 42 uh, vinyl records, a total of 42 records for a total of 400 and fifty seven dollars and so um, I paid uh, 49 cents um, per record I generally get my records at the Goodwill my Goodwill is 49 cents on occasion uh, I may pay a dollar um, or maybe two dollars depending on what the record is um, but none of the records that I actually sold so far um, cost uh, more than 49 cents um, I think maybe one of them um, I paid a dollar for. And so uh, 42 records, $457. That means that the average um, sale price for my records have been $10.88. Uh, I do like to try and make a profit of at least $10 when I buy an item to resell on eBay. Um, mainly all of my records have sold on eBay uh, although I sell both on eBay and Macari, I haven't posted, but maybe two or three records on Macari. Um, one has sold on Macari. And so $457 I've made, um, average sale price was $10.88. Now, I do need to take out the eBay fees on, on that um, average um, price. The eBay fees for records is 12.9%. And so that brings my um, my profit down to nine dollars and forty eight cents per record, and then minus my um, cost of goods. So basically, nine dollars I've made um, as a profit on each record that I've sold so far. Um, the highest record I've sold for thirty four dollars and ninety nine cents. I think that was the Supreme um, uh, record. And then uh, probably the lowest cost has been $4.75. It was one that I just wanted to kind of get rid of. Um, so the cost, you know, the how I price the records uh, ranges based on the desirability of the record. So some of them are priced, you know, in the $30 range, some in a $20 range. Mainly I stay around, you know, $12.99, $14.99, $9.99. Um, some, uh, I may price it like $7.99. Um, so my hope is that, you know, going forward, um, as I'm learning what records to pick up, what genres do well, and what genres sell well, that I can increase my average sale cost. Um, so, so far, you know, so good. I think I will definitely continue selling vinyl records. For those of you out there who are resellers or interested in reselling, vinyl records uh, are definitely making a comeback. They are uh, desirable items. Um, there are certainly collectors out there who are looking for a certain record or a certain release of that record or a certain album cover. So, one of the things you want to look at is you want to make sure that the uh, album cover um, is in good condition. Um, you'll look up and you'll find some um, new sealed ones or you'll find some that are partially still shrink, shrink wrap like this Judge record. Um, and then you want to, you know, look at the different genres, what sells well. You can do some research by going to eBay and looking at the sold comp for records and you can look them up by genres. Um, the genres that have worked for me so far um, are uh, R&B, rhythm, uh, rhythm and Blues, jazz records, um, some pop and rock uh, records. I haven't uh, found any like metal um, records. I know they do sell well. Um, I've sold a couple hip hop 
Um, hip hop uh, is definitely a good genre, uh, hard to find at yard sales and thrift stores. And so just wanted to give you guys just a view um, of what my experience has been selling vinyl records over the last 14 months. And uh, to encourage you to step out, try it. Um, if you're interested, it could be just, you know, an, an, another avenue for you to make a profit on eBay or Macari. Thank you guys for listening. Have a great day.